today I'm going to be installing this Pro Series trailer jack. Uh, the only thing that we truly need to do is to attach it to the trailer. And it seems like you got four screws, a bolt, and a bracket. Alright, so we got our bracket and four bolts. I'm going to need to get something to uh, raise the trailer a bit more higher than what we currently have. So let me see if I can find something. All right, as you can see, got the trailer jack, uh, got the screws that we're going to use, which also have their corresponding nuts. What I'm basically going to do is take this trailer jack and kind of move it up in the area where it's going to be able to equally support the weight of the trailer. Uh, and it looks like that these brackets are gonna go flat down on the body like this. So this part is gonna touch the body. All right, looking at this, uh, I'm having some questions on if I truly want to do the bracket like this. And the reason being is because it's going to be a pain to screw it on. Okay, so I got one side on. I did flip the uh, our bracket. So by flipping this over, I move that out the way. As you can see, we have far greater access to the threads. So I highly recommend that uh, if you guys have a Pro Series trailer jack, it's got some very, very good reviews about it. I love it, blends in, looks beautiful. Uh, has a capacity of 2,000 pounds, this trailer. Uh, from stock, it's stated uh, 1,000 pounds. So, and as you can see, I'm not really hauling anything. It's just bushes cut down bushes when it comes to doing labor I absolutely love it I'm an IT guy by day but I'm telling you when it's time to clock off man I love to get my hands dirty baby as you can see I already pulled up these bushes I'm gonna knock down these stumps uh, plan on replacing this fence get rid of this garbage knock down these bushes remove the stumps be on my merry way but it's nothing like having your own to do your own and that's what i'm doing i love it